Call of Fame. This is Tony Night Podcast. I'm your host, Austin. Um, we got Big Show tonight. We got P2 Anthony on the show. Welcome to the show, P2. How you doing, man? Thanks for having me. Uh, we got a lot of stuff to talk about. Let's get right to it. Whole new segment. Walking Day comments being reprinted in full color for the first time this Halloween. Issue 1 will be available on October 7th. Can't wait for that. My movie review of Simba Party Massacre 1 and 2. Now, I love Simba Party, Hot Girls, Ask Simba Party, A Guy Kills People, like always a slasher movie. There's Rib Nudy, who doesn't like nudity in a horror film. That's plus 10 points. The guy that kills is 10 plus points. Um, I'll give it a 5 star movie because there's hot girls and there's girls that survive. So that's another A plus for that. Um, Summer Party Massacre Part 2, the second one, it's like uh, Mama Mia meets horror. It's kind of like a, a musical kind of thing with the killer sings a song before he kills his prey. It's kind of like Mama Mia meets horror. And it's kind of weird and crazy at the same time, but the music he sings is really catchy and it's stuck in my head. Just like Mama Mia, I love that movie. Moving on. <laughs> It's a very good movie. Uh, Different Girls is very hot, so I give it a five star movie. Um, number three, The Conjuring Three: The Devil Made Me Do It will hit theaters on June fourth, twenty twenty one. Can't wait for that. Horror movie opens twenty four hours, drops on VOD and digital and HD and DVD on August eighteenth. Can't wait for that. A shout out to Mike Silk, owner and host of the Champs Wood. If you want some great graphics, go check him out. He does graphics for our show. He does graphics for his show. Check him out, Champs Wood. Uh, number six, Black Dufu. I can't pronounce his last name, but you know who I'm talking about. The original Chucky guy that does Chucky in the movie has confirmed to be in the upcoming TV series. Deep Blue 3 will be on Blu-ray and DVD on August 25th. Go check that out. Let's get right to the questions. Number one, what is your favorite horror movie? Favorite horror movie? Ah, man, that's tough. Overall, I'd probably say as far as overall great movie, I would probably say the remake of The Thing, John Carpenter. Was it 1986? I I love that movie overall. That and Halloween 1. Yeah, um, that's a good one. Um, number two, what is the movie? What is the movie The Fall of Camp Blood about? Fall of Camp Blood is a continuation of Friday the Thirteenth Part Four, so which is my favorite movie, by the way. So after Part Four, it's a year after um, Part Four ends, and they're going to actually break down the camp. They're going to demolish it. So basically, the fall of Camp Blood. So the people that own the actual cottages send their kids back to go get their belongings before they destroy it. And when they go back, they realize that Jason's back. And it, it seems like in, in my notes that you're going to be in that movie. Yeah, I'm actually um, one of the major characters in that. Um, I play um, the brother of um, uh, John, uh, Rob Deere from Part 4. Oh, wow. That's really yep. cool. Number three, how is it like being in the horror movie Vengeance? Awesome. So, like, I, I don't know about you, but we're probably similar. Growing up, um, I was just a huge Friday the 13th fan. When, when I was five or six years old, I used to watch the movies with a little mask. Then I used to go to conventions, and then I became somewhat friends with some of the Jasons. Then I was lucky enough to be asked to be on Friday the 13th Vengeance. So, did that, went face-to-face with Jason Brooks, the Jason. So, uh, it's, it's like a dream come true. It's, uh, sometimes I gotta pinch myself, so I, I'm lucky. I love it. Now, last, last episode we had Jason Brooks on the show, and we talked about Vengeance a little more into detail, but he didn't answer my question. He, and the okay, question well, and the question is, will there be a sequel to Vengeance? He said there was talks about it, but he didn't confirm it. So... <coughs> Yeah, it's official now. We we went live on the site maybe, I think, last week, and we announced that we're actually going to make a Vengeance 2. So Jason Brooks and I are writing uh, Vengeance 2. Jason Brooks is actually going to direct it, 
And right now we're doing, we're, we're not done with the script, but we're doing casting and the script. So we're looking to shoot probably March, April of 2021. So there will be a Vengeance 2, yes. Uh, yes, because the, the first one was amazing. I mean, awesome. I loved it. I loved the characters. I love Jason Brooks's character, like Redneck. He he made the whole movie because he that was the comedy part that I loved. Right, Louis. Yeah, you know Jason Brooks played Louis too, right? Yeah. Yeah, you told me about that. So I'm very happy about that. Please go check out Vengeance wherever it's posted. I think it's on YouTube, I think. Correct. It's on YouTube, yes. Will the second movie be on YouTube too? The second movie will be on YouTube and actually right now on Indiegogo you can buy a DVD or a Blu-ray and one person gets a golden ticket that we hide inside one of the DVDs or Blu-ray. It, that if you get that golden ticket, you get to be killed on screen by Jason for free. Sweet. Yeah. You hear that, fans? Go get that golden ticket. Now, Hall of Fans, I got announced something six episodes away until our season finale. Um, we're almost there, and I cannot wait for next episode. We have a Hall of Icon. Well... I think Kim is a uh, color icon. He's Clint Howard, Wine Howard's brother. So go check that episode out. It'll be coming out soon. I haven't interviewed him yet, but it, we will eventually uh, next week. So go check that out. Check this out when you're on social media. Thanks for being on the show. It's been a great pleasure to have you. And stay scared. Thank you. I'll see you soon.